Look at that. It's perfect. Why would you want to eat soggy fries? I'm about to spend a hundred dollars. What's up, Killer here. I'm about to go into Wendy's today and see the best items we can get for a hundred dollars. Come follow me. Let's get it. Can I order the breakfast baconator, your classic, your bacon sausage, egg, and cheese, biscuit, and and sausage, and egg, and cheese, and your honey, butter, your frosty chicken you know? biscuit. And how much is that so far? Fifteen dollars. Fifteen dollars. Can I get the bacon jalapeno cheeseburger? Let me get some barbecue cheeseburger. Let me get barbecue sauce. Can I get some, some honey mustard? Can I get the vanilla frosty? Sure. What size you want? Let me get the large. Okay, the large one. All right. Round one. The vanilla frosty chino. It's cold brew with some frosted cream mixed in with some ice. Let's do this. And there's vanilla frosty cream inside the coffee. We're adding some nice little sweetness. I'm digging it. Nice, smooth, creamy. You know, you still get that flavor. I'm not a huge like black coffee fan, so this is a this is a nice pick me up for the morning time. I usually put jelly on my biscuit, so this is this is new for me. But look out! Look at that glow. That shine though. So the great thing about the honey butter biscuit is that the biscuit is a little dry, but the honey and the, the butter adds more moisture to it. So when you're chewing on it, you get that nice, you know, crusty, crunchy feel from the biscuit, but then the honey adds that, that level of moisture that you need to keep your mouth moist. Next up, we have the bacon, egg, and cheese biscuit. The classic morning sandwich, the bacon, egg, and cheese, but just on a biscuit. I love biscuits. They do have other options. You can also get a croissant. The breakfast baconator. So we're just gonna give you that inside look. You got the sausage. Ooh, and you got bacon in there. Ooh, you got two layers of bacon in there. Okay. This is good. You see, sometimes you go to your corner store, right? and you want some extra bacon? Well, if you want extra bacon, order the breakfast bacon later. Some good -ish. And so for the last of the sandwiches in this round, we have a sausage, egg, and cheese croissant. It's in a square because Wendy's doesn't cut corners. Fun fact. All right, let's do this. But yeah, what I love about croissants so much is that they're, they're always super soft. They're light and airy, so you don't feel like you're getting a bunch of carbs. You know, I don't really care about cards, but you know, it's cool. Last but not least, we have seasoned potatoes. <laughs> so the seasoned potatoes is not like your average fry. It's very spicy because of the mixed seasoning. It's a dope French fry. Boom, so out of all these options, my favorite thing is the breakfast baconator. You're getting a whole piece of sausage, two layers of bacon with the cheese, a freshly cooked egg, and it's nice, smooth, bright. So for only four twenty nine, that's a lot. Not to eat. <sighs> Clearly, I like the vanilla version. So now we're about to try the chocolate version. But fun fact, I'm more of a vanilla kind of guy than a chocolate kind of guy. Chocolate's just too much. But if you love chocolate, then this is definitely. Your cup of tea. Again, it's not. It's your cup of coffee. <laughs> you said it was your cup of tea. Yeah, but that's how this saying goes. That's how this saying goes, okay? So, yeah, same thing like before. It's not too coffee for it, so you're not getting the huge, like, bitter taste. And the cream sort of mellows it out. And you do get, like, that hint of chocolate in there. I'm digging it. The classic bacon, egg, and cheese. I got the bacon. So organized, so beautiful. And Fun fact, all the breakfast sandwiches are made with fresh cracked eggs, people. In a fast food restaurant, that's amazing. Mm. So for $3.79, you can get all of this. Bacon crunchy, bread smooth, 
the eggs is fresh. So next up, we have the honey butter chicken biscuit. Look at that, look at that crunchiness. Ooh, for $2.89, you get a whole biscuit with some chicken. That's a good deal. Next up, we have the sausage biscuit sandwich. If you love biscuits, there's a lot of different options. You could have your biscuit, you got the breakfast baconator, where you got bacon, cheese, and eggs. But if you want to be basic, you could just go with the basic sausage and biscuit, you know, stay simple. Next up, we have the sausage, egg, and cheese burrito. I want to say in college, this was like girls' favorite thing to eat in the morning time. Like this was, they used to move burritos like crazy. There we go, let me fill that up. I used to roll burritos back in the days. I'm pretty good at it. Again, that cheese is amazing. American cheese, classic, with the sauces and eggs. The best thing about Wendy's breakfast is that their breakfast comes with so many different options, right? You could go with the burrito bread, the croissant, the biscuit, you could go sausage, bacon, cheese. Next up, we have the maple bacon chicken croissant. And it's toasted, look at that, look at that little, mm. Shout out to the Wendy chef. Okay. Once you take your first bite, you immediately taste that maple syrup on it. So, mm, it's in your face. Love it, the croissant, bunch of butter. The maple, again, adds that nice sweetness to it. Just a different flavor. And who doesn't love bacon? Besides vegans, vegans don't love bacon. You like that? Just your beard. Okay. Cool. Oh, I appreciate Lastly, that. My beard. Welcome. I've been growing it for a while. <laughs> I appreciate that. Was a, that was a nice. That was a nice compliment. Yeah. Last but not least, we have the oatmeal bar. Look at that. And it's a square. I'm lying. It's a rectangle. Let's try it. This is everything you want in the oatmeal bar. It's sweet, but it feels healthy. You get the cranberries, a nice little burst of flavor. My favorite thing for round two is the maple chicken bacon croissant. For only $4.29, you get all these delicious things in one breakfast. Round three, lunch. So we're about to do round three. Fun fact, I didn't plan this, but Wendy's old uniforms used to look like this. That's movie magic, people. It's movie magic. Nice and smooth. You taste that little hint of chocolate. Just melts in your mouth. The classic. Look at that. Ooh. Immediately once you bite, you get that crunch from the lettuce and onions. If you're looking for a classic cheeseburger, you get all those beautiful things the mayo, the pickles, the tomato, lettuce, burger, and cheese. Super fly, super good. Shout out to Dave. The barbecue chicken sandwich. We have fried onions with pickles, monster cheese, and two buns. So this is delicious, right? You, again, crunchiness from the chicken. Also, the, the fried onions adds another layer to that. But then the barbecue sauce, that's what really hits. The super it got some tang to it, a little spice, and it's barbecue sauce. How can you not love barbecue sauce? And it's nice and A lot of people say that their stuff is spicy. This is definitely spicy. You get that, that nice little kick. Crunchy, small, delectable, spicy chicken nuggets. And then the follow-up is the chili. Let's go in. There we go. I used to go to chili competitions and just keep eating the tasters. Just keep eating chili. I'm a, I'm a big chili guy. You know, if it's a cold day like today, it's, it's freaking cold outside, it's the perfect thing to eat. Warm you up a little bit. Woo! Look at that. Like, that's how you know it's a good burger when it just layers up. See that stackness? It's not flat. Wah -wah! Yo, we got mayo, pickles, ketchup, onions, tomatoes. Look, look at this lettuce. They cut it into a square. Oh. Shout out to the Dave single, but I'm a fan of the Big Bacon Classic. 
You get all these things, it's nice and fulfilling. For $6, bro, come on. Next up, we have the Baconator fries. So you got this beautiful creamy cheese sauce on top of your fries, and then they sprinkle a bunch of little bacon pieces on top, which elevates it to a higher level. It's the perfect thing for you. If you love creamy cheese and fries. Chelsea's a little weird. She likes to dip her fries in ice cream. Don't know. Listen, only the frosty. So anyone who dips their fries in the ice cream, you're wasting your ice cream and your fries. Look at that. It's perfect. Why would you want to eat soggy fries? We have the Parmesan Caesar chicken salad. I can just feel the vitamins and nutrition entering my blood veins. So if you come into Wendy's and you're like, man, I don't want all that chicken. I don't want no biscuits. I don't want no ice cream. They have a beautiful salad here made for you. You get that nice Parmesan cheese, but adds that little, like, little bit of taste to it. But then you get this beautiful Caesar dressing, which, you know, brings it all together with a little bit of chicken. You can't go wrong. My favorite thing is the spicy chicken nuggets because it's actually spicy. You get that nice little kick in there. You can't go wrong with that. $1.89, that's $2, bro. That's cheaper than taking the Metro. Round four, let's get it. Let's start with the bacon jalapeno cheeseburger. So you're getting the classic burger with some nice and creamy cheese, bacon, fried onions, jalapenos, and a spicy creamy sauce. Yeah, so if you're a fan of spicy things, this is the perfect thing for you. I'm digging it. I'm about to eat this beautiful vanilla frosty. Look at that. Mm. Vanilla, how can you go wrong? Love the vanilla frosty. Nice, classic, super smooth. Soft, not chunky. The avocado BLT sandwich. I know a lot of people are fanatics for avocado. Look at all that green. Green, green, green. Let's do this. Ooh. So this is great. As you can see, you get a burst of avocado. It just explodes. And it adds a nice creaminess to the crunchy chicken sandwich. <sighs> I don't get why people do this, but here we go. This is like, what do you, what do you get out of that? We got the chicken nugget. You know gonna dip. Right. Everything you expect from a chicken nugget, amazing barbecue sauce. Just like the spicy chicken nuggets is $1.89, I would definitely go with the spicy chicken nuggets over the chicken nuggets, which is way better. You get some spice, some flavor. The spicy chicken nuggets don't need no sauce. We have the classic Baconator. Double burger with the bacon in between. Oh, and bacon on top. Baconator, you know, during lunchtime, you just had a long shift. Your boss is annoying. That coworker that is always chatting to you that you don't want to talk to. Are you trying to say something? Chelsea, you sit so far away from me. <laughs> 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 this is the perfect thing when you're stressed and you just want to mm, suck your hearty to fill you up. You get two burgers, two layers of bacon with the mayo sauce and the cheese. This is for the working class. Next up, we have the spicy chicken sandwich. You have so many options to choose from if you want a spicy chicken sandwich. This is a little bit more simple, just tomatoes, lettuce, so if you don't want to get too complicated and you just want something simple for lunch. Last but not least, we have the Southwest Avocado Chicken Salad with some South French sauce, chicken, guacamole, bacon, pepper jack cheese, and mixed greens. Mm. So you're getting the perfect balance of, of nutrition, but then that bacon adds that flavor that you really want. You get the guacamole with the pepper jack cheese, and then the Southwest sauce just brings it all together. It's amazing. For round four, my favorite thing was the avocado BLT sandwich. One, I never had avocado and chicken before. It's nice, you get that nice smooth creaminess from it. It's refreshing, it cools you down a little bit. You know, explodes. For $6.99, you get guacamole, chicken, bacon for lunch. 
come on. If I had to choose out of everything, what I would get again is probably the spicy chicken nuggets. Love the hint of spice. Super small, compact, delectable, delicious. For only $1.89, you can't go wrong with that. Like, comment, subscribe. What you need to do is go to the comment section and tell them to send me to Europe so I could go and try some fast food in another country. No.